before this video gets started, I just wanted to say this will be the last week you guys see the um, setup as is. I'm actually in the process of moving the setup to somewhere else in the house. Um, it will be better for you guys, and as far as the camera messing up this time, that's on me. Uh, I thought it had a better charge than it did, and it cut out during the video, and it corrupted the data. So that's on me. I apologize for not having the webcam throughout the video. Um, with that being said, I am getting a new camera for the face cam part of things instead of having the GoPro uh, set up for the face cam just because it seems I'm just having issues with it. So I'm going to try a different camera, see if I do a better job with that one, and then just keep the other one um, for the card view at least for now. Um, but yeah, so I just want to let you guys know um, next week's videos will have like a screen up at least unless I can get it done in one week um, I've got to paint. I've got to move everything to the new spot I've got to like just get the whole backdrop set up beforehand with that being said I apologize again for the face cam not working throughout this video. I was pretty decent opening so but anyways I uh, hope you guys enjoy the video, and I will see you guys later. What's going on, guys? Dexter here with another Pokemon opening. I hope you guys enjoyed Sunday's video. I know it wasn't too nothing too crazy. With that being said, I want it to go a little bit bigger for Tuesday's video since it was kind of a dud. So last week, I, it was a dud Sunday video, and then Tuesday, it wasn't that great of a video either. And I don't want to do that again. I want you guys to have some kind of awesome content throughout the week. So today's video is going to be a little bit more action-packed than our random booster Tuesday normally would be. So today, we're actually not even doing eight boosters. We are doing a Copper Raja V box. I know you guys have seen these. These are a, a lot older than um, what I normally open. I try to keep it a little bit more fluid, but man, lately with the schedule, it's just been kind of rough. Um, but with that being said, we do have a Copper Raja V box, which I've heard some pretty good things about. Um, and then we did pull. I'm gonna slide this bad boy out of the way because he's, he's huge. All right, sorry, Copper Raja. We do have a Sun and Moon Lost Thunder three pack. And then we have a Sun and Moon Crimson Invasion 3-pack. Now, if you guys seen last Tuesday's video, we are looking for that secret rare water energy. I didn't rep the blue shirt because this video is just like everything all together. If we go for just Crimson Invasion next time, I'll pull out the blue shirt. With that being said, we do have these two as well. So I'm going to open up these first, and then we're going to get to the Copper Raja V-Box. We're going to do one at a time. There is the Alolan Executor uh, promo card. Pretty cool looking card. We're going to slide him in the back there. Uh, actually, we'll put them in the kind of cool section, I guess. I don't know. You know what? We'll put them over here so we know what we're opening. Here is the spicy code card for the three-pack. And uh, we did get the uh, inevitable Ho-Oh uh, coin. Very cool point, uh, coin, though. Just uh, I have a couple of them for sure. So slide it over there. And we got three packs of Sun and Moon Lost Thunder. So what do you guys think? You guys are a big fan of Sun and Moon Lost Thunder or not? Let me know down in the comments down below. That being said, let's open up these three and see what we get. I just opened those Dollar Tree packs uh, from Sunday's video or whatever. Um, and it is weird to open a regular pack again. I don't, I don't know if you guys know what I mean, but like three cards and then having a full booster pack. One, two, three, four. I think it is for Sunday Man Lost Thunder. We're going to find out. Water type energy. Mina. Alolan Dug Trio. Pinsir. Spinarak. Ninkata. Blitzel. Never seen that Pokemon before. Slowpoke. Bruxious, Reverse Larvitar. Ooh, we got a Holographic uh, Ampharos. Very cool looking Pokemon card. Slide him in the kind of cool section. So we got a pull nonetheless from it. That's uh, a lot better than most three packs. Sun and Moon Lost Thunders pack number two. There's that famous Tangula. There's a code card. One, two, three, four. Got an Electric type energy. Pinsir again. Ooh, memory energy. That's pretty cool looking energy. Kecleon. Tangula. I really like the Tangula. Alolan Vulpix. Snubble. Marini. Cyndaquil. I love Cyndaquil. Very cool Pokemon. I guess a thing for fire type energy or fire type Pokemon. Reverse Eevee. And a Slow King. Very interesting artwork there. Very cool. On to the last pack of Lost Thunder. I think. I don't know what's in the Copper Raja pack, so it could be um, something else as well in there for Sun and Moon. One, two, three, four. Got a Dark type energy. Carbink. Shinotic. Or Shinotic. Or Shinotic. I think it's Shinotic. I don't know. Kecleon. Onyx. Ralts. Cyndaquil again. Pineco. Combi. Reverse Hitmontop. That's pretty cool looking artwork. And a regular Lapras. 
So with that being said, the uh, Sun and Moon Lost Thunder just pulled a hollow rare, which is uh, better than most of the time when we open these three packs. So this is honestly might be my last three pack. I just I get tired of opening these and never getting anything great out of them. And moving on to the Sun and Moon Crimson Invasion pack. I'm going to open it up and I'll be right back. So here is the uh, holographic promo, Decidua. Pretty cool looking card, um, I guess. Like I like the holographic in the background, the sky, but the Pokemon himself is just kind of hidden. It's pretty, like, I don't know. It's kind of bland looking. I'll throw him back there. Here is the code card for the 10. I'm going to put it over here with the rest of them. And in these packs right here, there's going to be a secret rare water. Hopefully. Water energy. Hopefully. Uh, you know what? Not hopefully guaranteed guaranteed in one of these we did get a coin too i don't know why i left the coin out really cool coin i like that one a lot not a bad coin so we're gonna open these up and hopefully get one of them water type energies what do you guys think i think we're gonna get something out of one of these three packs there's a code card one two three four water type energy it's a sign larion or Laron, Leron, Laron, Dashing Pouch, Fighting Memory, Alolan Geodude, Aeron, Ghastly, Staryu, Cacnea, Reverse Spoink, and, ooh, a Como O. Regular Rare. Okay, wasn't in that one. Wasn't a sign. Maybe it's leading up to it. No, pack number two is going to have the Water Type Energy. Code card. One, two, three, four. Oh, fire type energy. It's reverse psychology. Diggersby, Mawile, Countercatcher, Shelmet, Swablu, Swinub, Numel, Mencino, Reverse Shellos, and a regular rare star me. Okay. Alright, that's fine. You know what? It's leading up to the last and final pack of the three pack. That's gonna be the one that's got it in it. There's code card. One, two, three, four. I don't have to say what kind of code card it was, because you guys already know. Kind of code card it was. Fighting type energy, nothing to do with water. Miltang, sea of nothingness. Is that mean? <laughs> There's gonna be a water energy. Gastrodon, Carablast, Feebas, looking for a water type energy. Look at him, so paranoid, freaked out. Where is it at? Salandit, Cubone, Weedle, Reverse Jangmo O, and the secret rare water type energy. <laughs> No, but I, I, I'm excited. Cartana GX. I know I didn't sound excited. I pulled something nonetheless. Not bad. Pretty cool looking card. I've never seen this card before. And what kind of Pokemon is that exactly? Is it a bug? What? Like, I've never seen this Pokemon. I'm gonna sleeve it up though. I got some uh, Crimson Invasion sleeves over here. So, pretty cool pull nonetheless. Hey, a three pack actually delivered something other than a holographic. So I'll take it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, what you guys came to see, the Copper Raja V-Box. We're going to open this bad boy up, and then I'll be right back to show you all the goodies inside. So just like that, we're into the Copper Raja V-Box. Uh, here is the regular size Copper Raja V promo card. Very cool looking card. I like Copper Raja a lot. He kind of got like downplayed because he was part of Rebel Clash, but I think he's pretty cool. And then you do get a uh, enlarged card. I don't know what you want to call these, the jumbo cards or whatever. They're very cool looking. I want to find a frame for these. I think it would be so neat to like each one have a certain frame and put them in like the uh, studio here somewhere. Maybe not on camera, but just in general. I think it would be very neat to find a frame that fit these. But uh, very cool. I like them a lot. A lot of people either hate jumbo cards or love jumbo cards. So I'm one of them that I think they're very neat and hold a special place. So we're going to throw that Copper Raja back there. I think I gave you guys the code card, but there's a code card just in case I didn't. Um, the packs that you did get are Rebel Clash, Cosmic Eclipse, Rebel Clash, and a Burning Shadows pack. Oh, maybe we'll go on a Charizard hunt. Maybe. We're going to go in this order just because it kind of splits it up. So, Rebel Clash is the first pack that we open. Kind of sad to see Rebel Clash go so fast just because it's like my first set that I've kept up with. Um, like It's the first one I bought pre-ordered stuff for. Um, so, Rebel Clash is just going to hold a place for me. I'm just... Uh, you know, I always will remember that was like the first one I bought pre-ordered stuff, looking forward to it in stores um, as far as getting back into things. So one, two, three, four. We did get a spicy code card. So Psychic Energy, Twin Energy, Phalinx, Masquerain, Snover, Padov, Glaring Dermaka, Atina, Scyther, Reverse Glaring Dermanitan, which is a reverse rare, and oh, an Elder Goss V Full Art. 
No way. This is a very like really good card to pull. I have not pulled it either. Like, come on. That's that's what we need. That was that's a, that's a decent one right there. Get a sleeve for sure. On to Cosmic Eclipse. I've heard a lot of good things about these uh, Copper Roger V boxes. I don't know why, but supposedly they're supposed to have a pretty good pull rate. Ooh, it hid the code card from Cosmic Eclipse, so hey, I'll take it. One, two, three, four. Metal Energy, Lily's Full Force, Clay, Prinplup, that's pretty cool. Piplup, Cosmog, Bonita, Crab Brawler, Gravana, Reverse Torkoal, and a Weavile. Man, you can't get tired of them Weaviles from Cosmic Eclipse. Onto the Sword or Sword and Shield Rebel Clash pack. I don't know why I said Sword and Shield beforehand, but here we are. You know, we're in here. We're in it. Another code card. One, two, three, four. What do you guys think? You gonna think we're gonna get that Charizard? There's no way. <laughs> Dark Energy, Bronzong, Nugget, Skuntank, Sandy Gas, Roly Coley, Stunky, Clefairy, Voltorb, Reverse Phantom, and a Copper yeah. Rush of B. Is that not crazy to pull a Copper Raja V in the V box? That's got to be like a really, really high chance to get both of those. That You know, it's not the promo. That's like the card to pull. So it's going to go in a sleeve. I don't think I pulled this. I'd be really surprised if I did and don't remember it. Pretty cool. On to the final pack. Hopefully some last pack magic. Save it for last because it is sun and moon burning shadows. If you are not. Oh, you hear that? that crinkle. If you're not familiar with why Burning Shadows is the set to buy, invest in right now, you're behind. All right, we didn't get anything, but that's okay. One, two, three, four. This set is unlike any other set. Psychic Energy, Curlia, Olivia, Lunatone, Ryulu, Alolan Grimer, Noibat, Horsia, Alolan Vulpix, Reverse Lana, and a regular rare Tangro. Recap. So all in all, not a bad opening. I'm pretty excited that I opened all of this just because I wanted to make sure I give you guys something good this week. So we started off with the Copper Raja V regular card, not the V card, or like the promo card. We got an Elder Goss V full art, which is the card to pull today. Like that is the card we are the most happy about for sure. Or I am. Let me know in the comments down below your favorite card we pulled today. Copper Raja V promo card from the V box. Cartana GX, which is uh, I, like I don't know what I was looking for, honestly. Like uh, <laughs> I was looking for the secret rare water card, but we got Cartana GX instead. Hey, we pulled something in a three pack. You can't complain. There is the Decidua promo card. We got an Ampharos card from the Sun and Moon uh, Lost Thunder pack. Pretty excited for that. Very cool looking card. I don't know how much the glare shows off for you guys, but very cool holographic. Then we got an Alolan, Alolan Executor from the three pack from the uh, Lost Thunder pack. Okay, so the camera battery died on the face cam, but I think it just died for real. I don't think it was fully charged because um, it was kind of blinking, yelling at me, but I was trying to finish the video out. But anyway, with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope this video was a little bit better than the normal video. Um, I also hope that it repaired the file like it said it was doing this time instead of how it says it's repaired the file and then I don't get to use that file. But with that being said, I hope the opening for the cards themselves was a little bit better and I will see you guys Saturday for the podcast. I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.